Welcome back to Blockchain Pill. In this video, you are going to learn how to buy tokens inside the ICP ecosystem. After watching this video, you are gonna know what ICP wallet to use, what decentralized exchange to go to to buy the ICP tokens, how to track and find new ICP tokens, and what platforms similar to Pump Fund you can use on ICP to launch your very own ICP tokens. I think now is the best time to actually learn this stuff because when the real altcoin season is gonna be here, you will not have you know a lot of time to do it. And well, if you're watching this video and the altcoin season is here, I'm trying to make this video short just so that you can start buying ICP tokens right now. So without losing any more time, let's jump straight into it. And we're gonna start with the ICP wallet. So for this video, we are gonna use uh, one of the newer ICP wallets. This one is called Oisy Wallet. This is one of the best performing wallets. This is one of the fastest ones. And uh, we're gonna see just how many things you can do inside this wallet. So I'm gonna create a wallet right now for you guys. And uh, you should follow those steps exactly. So we click on create new. You can use your touch ID. If you have a regular computer, then you will use your numpad, you know, to add like a password. After you do that, you will receive an internet identity. You need to save this because this is gonna be your identity inside the internet computer protocol. If you forget this number and you wanna log in back to your account, you're gonna have a problem because it's not gonna let you. After you save it, click on continue and uh, voila, you know, your wallet is now being generated. Now, your public keys that people usually worry, you know, about losing are gonna be stored inside your internet identity, which will forever live inside your laptop. So, you know, no more losing your wallets, no more losing your 12 word seed phrase, you know, everything is now saved into your very own internet identity. So this is the wallet's interface. Uh, you can see that the wallet actually exists inside the browser. And the cool thing about Oisy is that not only can you hold, you know, ICP ecosystem tokens, but you can also hold Bitcoin. You can also hold Ethereum and ERC20 tokens, even Solana. And I would guess that Solana tokens as well and USD tokens and uh, USDT, which is super cool. Now that we have a wallet and this only took us like one minute, we can go and connect to Kong Swap, and we're gonna select connect with Oisy Wallet. We're gonna get this little pop-up here. We will click on approve, and there we are. We logged in into the Kong Swap decentralized exchange where we can buy, you know, any token that we want. Now, in order to be able to actually buy tokens, you will need the base token on this network. In this case, it is ICP. You know, when you're on the Solana blockchain, you need to buy stuff using Solana. On BNB, you need the BNB token. On ICP, of course, you need the ICP token. We go to our OISI wallet, we click on ICP, we copy this address here at the bottom, and then we go to Binance or to any other centralized exchange, and we send, you know, ICP to this address. And I'm only gonna send like one ICP because, well, we don't need to buy a lot of stuff right now. It's just for demonstration purposes. ICP is extremely fast, so usually it should get to the, to the account fairly quickly. So let's uh, refresh this and it should already be here. And there we go. We have our almost one ICP. It's uh, 0 0.0003 was uh, the fee, you know, to withdraw from Binance. Cool. So now we have our wallet, we have our ICP, and we are logged into our favorite DEX. Let's see what can we buy. Kong is the token of Kong Swap, so I think that this is a great buy right now. If you ever used any decentralized exchange outside of ICP, it's uh, literally the same. We just buy, you know, some Kong, and uh, we swap. We have to approve the transaction. And after we approve the transaction, we will no longer have ICP in our account and instead we'll have Kong. It's just so easy. There we go. We exchange one ICP into 416 Kong. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. So now you know everything about, you know, what wallet to use, what decks to go to and how to actually perform a swap, which is the easy part. You know, the hard part really is, you know, finding good tokens and finding exciting tokens that you can actually invest in. And there are a few websites where you can actually track all the ICP tokens and, you know, decide what you are going to buy. Those websites are dexscreener.com slash ICP. You're going to see all the ICP tokens here. And the cool thing about it is that you can also 
see the charts and you can see, you know, the price movement on any given time frame. So we can see here the cloud token. This actually had a massive run in, uh, I believe, starting in November. If you knew about the cloud token, maybe in November, you would have made 100x. So this is why people should know how to trade on decentralized exchanges. This is not listed on Binance. This is not listed anywhere. You know, this is a token that you can only buy with an ICP wallet and on an ICP DEX. Cool, you can track all kinds of tokens on DEX screener. You can check them out by, you know, volume, by liquidity, by market cap, and so on and so forth. Another ICP website where you can actually track ICP tokens is called just that, icptokens.net. And you can see all the ICP tokens here. This also has a cool thing called ICP bubbles, where you can see every day, week, or month, how the tokens have been performing. It can also give you valuable information if you know where to look. Cool. Most of the money that you make is by buying early. If you don't buy early, if you buy a token after it went up 100x, 1000x, maybe you're going to do a 2x. But the people who bought it, you know, in the beginning, instead of a 1000x, they're going to have a 2000x. So it's such a big difference that buying early makes. And the earliest you can actually buy a token is uh, when the token is actually launching. And Pump Fun has really changed the game when it came to launching meme tokens, because now for the first time ever, you don't have to be a developer to launch a token. You just need a picture, a ticker, and you know a short description, and voila, you have a token. The biggest ICP Pump Fun-like platform is called launch.bob.fun. And uh, let me actually show you how, how easy it is to launch. So you just need a, a name here, let's say blockchain pill, the ticker would be pill, a short description, this is a test token. And you know, you just add an image and you click on create new coin and you have a new coin. So it's just that simple. It, it literally takes you like 30 seconds to launch a token. And uh, I think that this is the reason why the entire bull run this far has been mostly about meme tokens. We've, we've seen a few tokens launch from this and actually make it pretty big uh, inside the ICP ecosystem. And uh, here is where you can check out the latest launches and you can see you can enter those tokens on fairly small market caps, right? Like 8,000 market cap, 2,000 market cap, 1,000 market cap and stuff like that. Imagine if this goes to, let's say a million dollars or $10 million, you know, you're going to make 100x, 1,000x, 5,000x. So this is really where the real big money are made. But also here is where, you know, most of the risk actually is. Keep in mind, 99.99% of all the tokens launched went to zero. So always be cautious and never invest more money than you're willing to lose. And I feel that meme tokens have been such a crazy thing to happen to, you know, cryptocurrencies, because for the first time ever, we've seen people who invested, you know, 10 bucks or 25 bucks or 100 bucks and turned that into millions of dollars. So this is unique to crypto. This is like winning the actual jackpot, but just keep in mind that that doesn't really happen for everybody. And with that, I wish you happy trading. Welcome to the ICP ecosystem, and I'll see you in the next video.